The Mike Wagner Show is powered by Sonic Web Studios. Hi, this is Mia Mohsen Zia, also known as Mia No Time for Love. Check out my latest book, Missing, available in print and ebook format on Amazon. It's now time for the Mike Wagner Show, powered by Sonic Web Studios. Visit online at sonicwebstudios.com for all your needs. The Mike Wagner Show can be heard on Spreaker, Spotify, iHeartRadio, YouTube, iTunes, Anchor FM, Radio Public, and the MikeWagnerShow.com. Mike brings you great guests and interesting people from all across the globe. So sit back, relax, and enjoy another great episode of the Mike Wagner Show. Hey everybody, it's Mike from the Mike Widener Show, powered by Sonic Web Studios. Visit online at sonicwebstudios.com for all your needs. Look at a professional website without breaking your budget. Sonic Web Studios is the answer. Sonic Web Studios offers fast, affordable custom web designs that blow the competition away. Call today, 1-800-303-3960. That's 1-800-303-3960. Or email to support at sonicwebstudios.com. Mention the Mike Widener Show, get 20% off your first project. Sonic Web Studios, take your image to the next level. Also, time to give official shout out to our official sponsor of the Mike Widener Show, international warring author Mia Molson Zia. If you love fast paced mysteries, you'll love Missing by Mia Molson Zia, available on Amazon in paperback and ebook. Missing is fast paced and intriguing with an unforgettable twist. It takes place in four countries, two strangers, one target, where truth is an illusion and those you love will be the first to go missing. It's available on Amazon in paperback and ebook. Missing by Mia Molson Zia has garnered great reviews and evil love and endorsed by Howard celebrities, including Joanna Cassie, Forge Riley, and many else. So grab your copy today for Girls Missing by Mia Molson Zia, available on Amazon. Also, the Mike Widener Show can be heard on the MikeWidenerShow.com on over 30 podcast platforms, including Facebook, SoundCloud, Spreaker, Spotify, and iHeartRadio. Also, Anchor FM, iTunes, Google Play, Amazon, Audible, and Apple Music. And take the Mike Widener Show with you on any mobile device. Subscribe to the Mike Widener Show on the YouTube channel. Follow the Mike Widener Show on Instagram and Twitter today. And for great gift ideas, go to Amazon.com and check out the Mike Widener Show podcast for T-shirts, pop sockets, hoodies, throw pillows, and more. And for more great merchandise and great books, go to Amazon.com slash Mia Molson Zia for uh, great books like Missing, Once and Wrinkles, also T-shirts, pop sockets, phone cases, and a lot more. Also support the Mike Widener Show on Anchor FM along with PayPal and... Anchor FM slash support and the Mike Widener show.com. Make sure you give generously today. He's backed by popular demand. Uh, he's been known to uh, be on the show and he's uh, the guitarist from Bronzeville station. We had him on with um, featuring Sonic Toonsmith, this side of somewhere and next act is paradise. And we also talked about as well too beyond the pale and psychedelic rodeo. And he played some great music. And this time we're going to talk about his new release, black swan theory. And we'll be featuring the song, Let's get along. And the critics are saying that this is the best work yet. And back by popular man, ladies and gentlemen, from somewhere in Michigan, the very popular guitarist and back by pop and demand of Mike Wagner show, Billy Craig. Billy, good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening. Thanks for joining us once again. Mike Wagner, thank you so much for fitting me in today. I appreciate it. And I love uh, doing your show. Thanks for always. Uh, I always like to put you right uh, at the beginning and the top of the list of my radio tour. Oh, that's amazing. Yes. And, I, and I'm and i I'm glad I get mentioned all over, too. So, yeah. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I mean, that's just so incredible. I got to say that. So, of course, we had you on before, too. Talked about your amazing career with uh, Brownsville Station. And, of course, it's known for smoking in the boys room. And um, you also had uh, Sonic Toonsmith, this side of somewhere. Let's get along. We also talked about Beyond the Pale and Psychedelic Rodeo. And if you want more information about uh, Billy Craig, you can go to the Mike Widener Show and, um, you know, click on Billy Craig. Craig, if you want to get the scoop. And here today, we're going to be talking about uh, the new album, Black Swan Theory, featuring Let's Get Along and um, talk talk about your uh, latest release. Uh, well, you know, it's it's something that kind of uh, kind of got the uh, song started uh, uh, during the beginning of the pandemic. And then uh, nobody knew it was going to hang out this long. So I ended up uh, actually finishing out the album and uh, Black Swan Theory, if you Google the title, you'll see it's got a couple of different meanings, meanings but it really kind of uh, fits uh, the songs. There's 14 tracks on there. I did, for the first time, uh, added uh, three cover songs mm -hmm. that I was real... Uh, actually, we talked about one of them uh, the last time we were, uh, uh, I was on your show. 
Mm -hmm. It was a Jackson Brown song. And uh, so I ended up covering three songs and the rest are all written and produced by me. Mm. Yeah, I do remember that. I think you played one of them, too, last time we spoke. And I think that was about last year. And that's definitely before the, before the pandemic. It was about a year or a year and a half ago. I can't remember. I had you on so many times. I've lost tracks. <laughs> yeah, it was a while back. And that was the exact song. And 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 I just started messing around with it and was like, wow, this sounds kind of cool. And uh, ended up finishing it out. Mm -hmm. and, and of course, you also had some uh, other music as well, too. And maybe just a bit about the um, Black Swan Theory and uh, how'd you come up with the title? The title actually is Black Swan Theory. And I was just looking at it uh, today, as a matter of fact. But essentially, there was a, a, a wives tale kind of thing uh, uh, in, Ch in China, of all things, that black swans didn't exist. And after, I don't know, a couple hundred years, they figured out they found one and they go, wow, black swans do uh, exist. And it just <laughs> kind of kind of fit my music career because I exist and, mm -hmm. and I, I've, I've been out here for a long time trying to uh, really hit hit a home run and, and it's been a long road. And then the other uh, the other meaning uh, is about uh, epic uh, things happening Uh kind of like the pandemic. So as I was writing the songs, I really didn't try to tilt it too much in that direction, but I, I kind of felt like I did a little bit, but I didn't want to be overboard with it kind of thing. Mm -hmm. And I just, you know, when I saw the title Black Swan Theory, I just kind of fell in love with it. And I'm going, that's, that's a great name for an album. And uh, I looked it up and I'm going, holy Smokes, that's really cool. <laughs> and it fit and, everything. And it sounds really cool as well, too, that um, I also thought about this well, too, that last time we talked while you're doing Black Swan Theory. Do you think the pandemic has uh, helped you in any way? Has it changed much or have you like changed your routine like you with the pandemic? And how does it affect you in any way, shape or form? Because I know a lot of musicians, the pandemic has uh, changed a lot, a great deal for them. Well, uh, not necessarily. I mean, it was more of a time issue for me and because it, it allowed me to uh, update and upgrade so, uh, upgrade my studio and I uh, got a lot of new gear. And, and when you do that, you have a, a huge learning curve that you go through. And I was able to kind of uh, navigate through that. And uh, it allowed me the time to really, really... Uh, work hard on the project and gave me a little window of opportunity. And I really wanted to take advantage of it and finish out a new album. And that's uh, exactly what I did. I'm, uh, I'm proud of that fact. And I like to keep coming up with new product and, and uh, new uh, music. Uh, I think it's important for artists to do that. And uh, I'm happy with it. Mm -hmm. You sound very happy with it, too. And how does Black Swan Theory uh, compare to, um, you know, all your works, too, especially with Beyond the Pale? We talked about Psychedelic Rodeo and Sonic Toonsmith, this size somewhere, and also um, Next Exit Parasites. How does Black Swan well, Theory well, compare it? Well, if you if you if you look at uh, the evolution of Billy Craig, the solo artist, my my the beginning was very uh Americana, country, kind of uh, Jimmy Buffett-ish in some points. Uh, still an edgy rock and roll feel to it. Uh, what I kind of did was, uh, you know, artists go through uh, a development phase, and I kind of feel that I did through the, the albums because my albums are eclectic. I kind of cover all the bases. So if you go... If you make a gauge from one to 10, one being country, 10 being rock and roll. Nowadays, I just tell everybody I'm all that, you know, <laughs> I, I'm one to 10. And so it's Americana, uh, rock based Americana. And uh, I'm, I, I, I'm pretty excited about uh, seeing where it's going. Uh, the numbers are actually looking really, really well. We've only had it. We only re released it for it's been about a month now. Wow. Is there, uh, well, yeah, yeah, a little over a month now. 
Mm -hmm. I forgot we're, we're in uh, December. <laughs> yeah, I know. It seems like time flies so fast. The next thing when I have you on, it's like, you're probably about two, three albums ahead. And you're like, wow, I did all this in such a time. <laughs> yeah. You know, and the other thing I wanted to mention was I kind of went all over the place. Cause when my first album, you have some like folk uh, acoustic bass kind of stuff. And then my fifth album was, was straight up instrumental, all guitar work. And uh, what I, I really did make a conscious effort to go, okay, so what am I going to do with Black Swan Theory? I knew that I wanted to bring vocals back in, but I didn't want to let go of the instrumental side. So there is, I think, two uh, for sure, maybe three instrumentals on the album as well because i'm a guitar player that's what i uh love to do and and that's always been what i hang my hat on and uh so so i made sure that i think i really uh kind of packaged it in a way that i'm pretty happy with at this point so going further Mm -hmm. and, and you got some amazing work as well, too. And besides, you played that Jackson Brown um, cover the last time. You also have a couple of covers and uh, maybe you hit upon a couple of songs from Black Swan Theory. We'll talk about that in just one minute. You listen to the Mike Wagner Show at the themikewagnershow.com, powered by Sonic Web Studios. Visit online at sonicwebstudios.com for all your needs. Look at a professional website without breaking your budget. Sonic Web Studios is the answer. Sonic Web Studios offers fast, affordable custom web designs at below the competition way. Call today, 1-800-303-3960. It's 1-800-303-3960. Or email to support at sonicwebstudios.com. Mention the Mike Wagner Show. Get 20% off your first project. Sonic Web Studios, take your image to the next level. Also time to give official shout out to our official sponsor of the Mike Wagner Show, international warring author Mia molson -Zia. If you love fast-paced mysteries, you'll love Missing by Mia molson -Zia. available on Amazon and paperback and ebook. Missing is fast-paced and intriguing with an unforgettable twist. It takes place in four countries, two strangers, one target, where truth is an illusion and those you love will be the first to go missing. It's available on Amazon and paperback and ebook. Missing by Mia molson -Zia has garnered great reviews and even loved and enjoyed by Howard celebrities, including Joanna Cassie, Forbes Riley, and many others. So grab your copy today for Goes Missing by Mia molson -Zia, available on Amazon. Also check out The Mike Widener Show on over 30 podcast platforms and themikewidenershow.com. Take us with you on any mobile device. Subscribe to The Mike Widener Show on the YouTube channel. Follow The Mike Widener Show on Instagram and Twitter today. And for great gift ideas, go to amazon.com and check out The Mike Widener Show podcast and amazon.com for slash me and Molson Zia for great books, merchandise, and a lot more. And don't forget to support us on Anchor FM, PayPal, and the themikewidenershow.com. Make sure you give generously today. We're here with the amazing uh, guitarist of Brownsville Station, Billy Craig, and um, he's got some great releases. We talked a bit, you know, in the previously, Sonic Toonsmith, The Sav Somewhere, Beyond the Pale, Psychedelic Rodeo, and more. And um, we're going to continue with the uh, Black Swan Theory here on the Mike Widener Show before we play one of the feature cuts. Um, you had, you had a, a couple of covers in there. We talked about Jackson Brown, and um, surprisingly, you had um, one by Brad and also Ario Speedwagon, two of my favorites. Tell us about those. Uh, you know what? The the Brad song, uh, I've always been, uh, I don't know why, I, I've always liked uh, Brad. And that particular song, The Guitar Man, has always kind of haunted me. And I always, in the back of my mind, thought, you know, one day I want to pull that song into the studio and, and do it up. And it really, really came well. And, and I actually did reach out to David Gates from Bread and just let him know that I was using the song. And uh, it was very cool. And the, uh, well, we talked about the Jackson Brown song. Uh, that particular song was, I don't know, it was just kind of one of the, you know, when a song kind of hits your soul and that one just kind of did. And uh, I think I, uh, I started messing around with it with my acoustic and I go, you know, I'm going to do that in the studio as well. But really the, uh, the, the crown jewel to me was the uh, turkey trot, the flying turkey trot. And that, if you listen to Ario Speedwagon, the very first live album, uh, there's there's a which is one of the best live albums. Uh, it's right up there with everybody else, really. From you know from the late seventies, mid seventies, but there was a big solo. One of my big heroes was named uh, Gary Richrath, uh, the late Gary Richrath, 
And he had his solo, but it came out of that instrumental that they always did, the Flying Turkey Trot. And I always thought, you know what, one day I'm going to take that in the studio and reimagine it in my own way. And I, I, I did uh, kind of stick to the formula, but in a, in, there were a few spots that I really kind of went off into my own direction, but I still came back to what they did. And it, the, uh, the funny thing about that in the studio, that was the song I used to test all my new gear. Wow. It, yeah. That's what I used to test all my different effects and stuff like that. So that was always the flagship of the album, really, in a way. <laughs> and I'm sure Gary Richraff would have been proud for you doing that song. That is amazing. <laughs> yeah. And, you know, my hope is, is that, uh, you know, uh, down the road that I can possibly do a video and really uh, do a tribute to Gary Richrath. If I could possibly pull that off, I'd be really happy about that. And we're certainly looking forward to it if it is well, too. And maybe a couple of songs from uh, Black Swan Theory before we play um, one of the feature ones. You can just uh, pick a couple and uh, tell us about those. Uh, I think that you are going to play the initial track off the album, which is actually the single that we are promoting uh, worldwide. Uh, but it's also being promoted to broadcast radio, uh, t mostly country radio, because it kind of... It's kind of an edgy Americana, uh, definitely has a rock feel to it, uh, but it fits there, I think, the most. So we're, that's the direction that we kind of went. And country's very uh, wide open to different uh, uh, interpretations now. So we're hoping to, to hit a home run with that. Mm -hmm. And that's certainly amazing as well, too. And we're going to play uh, Let's Get Along from the Black Swan Theory in Just One Minute by Billy Craig. You listen to the Mike Wagner Show at themikewagnershow.com, powered by Sonic Web Studios. Visit online at sonicwebstudios.com for all your needs. Also brought to you by our official sponsor of the Mike Wagner Show, international warring author Mia Molson's You Have Missing, available on Amazon and paperback and ebook. We'll be back with guitarist Billy Craig with um, Let's Get Along from the Black Swan Theory. After this time, out. the Mike Wagner show is powered by Sonic Web Studios. If you're looking to start or upgrade your online presence, visit www.sonicwebstudios.com for all of your online needs. Call 1-800-303-3960 or visit us online at www.sonicwebstudios.com to get started today. Mention the Mike Wagner show and get 20% off your project. Sonic Web Studios, take your image to the next level. Hey everybody, my name is Forbes Riley and I'm an American actress and a TV host. And I was delighted when I got my copy of Missing, which is Extraordinary Relation of Ordinary People based on a real life relationship. It's just, it's well written, it's amazing. You know, it talks about a man who has lost his wife and his daughter, and it's very well done. I'm gonna highly recommend that you go get your copy of Missing. It is a powerful, exciting read. Mr. Mian Moshe Zia, he is the author of Missing. And I wanna give a big shout out and a kiss all the way halfway around the world to my dear friend. Check him out at Mia's website. It's called www.miamotionzea.com. Missing, available on Amazon. Again, I'm Forbes Riley and I will see you again soon. Bye-bye. Hey, hey, this is Ray Powers and boy, are you in luck. Right place, right time. Tuned in to the Mike Wagner Show. You heard me. We're back with the amazing guitarist Billy Craig, Brownsville Station, here on the Mike Wagner Show with the new album, Black Swan Theory. Right now, here's the latest with Let's Get Along from Billy Craig right here on the Mike Wagner Show. Got a call from Caroline, heard it on the grapevine, all about a friend of mine. About some scuttlebutt coming down the pipeline, standing on my front line. You can say you don't like her purple umbrella or her friend from Ohio that comes from Havana. You can always find a way to make right seem wrong, but what the world needs. 
Friends Now is a way to get along. Let's get along. Jack plays it fast and loose. He's a little loud and he likes to sing the blues. An affliction to criticize, to stigmatize, watching the evening news. You can talk about the hubbub in the streets of Atlanta, from your panorama living in your sweet life cabana. You can always find a way to make right seem wrong, but what the world needs now is a way to get along. Let's get along! Haley lives with her Aunt Jane in Upper Main drinking sweet, sweet champagne. The chatter really don't matter. It's all about her friends. Hey, Jenny Solvay. Yeah, I thought so too. You can say they won't catch you anywhere in Vienna while you're flying first class Airbnb in Manhattan. You can always find a way to make right seem wrong. But what the world needs now is a way to get along. Let's get along. Let's get along. Great song by Billy Craig. That was Let's Get Along from Black Swan Theory. And uh, I love that song so much. And uh, tell us where we can uh, locate Let's Get Along, Black Swan Theory, and all your music at. Uh, actually, if you just go to billycraigmusic.us or uh, just Google Billy Craig Music, uh, make sure you put Billy Craig Music because there's an insurance salesman and also a, uh, a car service guy with the same name. Oh, one my. in Texas, one in Jamaica. I've been battling for the Billy Craig name for a few years now. It, if you Google Billy Craig, you'll, you'll see them in there and Depending on the day, uh, you'll see who's on top. But if you go Billy Craig Music, then you'll see all my stuff up there. Okay. We'll certainly do that. And what else can we expect from you in 2022 and beyond, Billy? Uh, well, what I'm hoping to do is put together a new live show uh, over the winter here. And what I'd really love to do is get out and start doing some uh shows in the spring and uh kind of hit it in the summer uh that's kind of my goal okay we're certainly looking forward to it and once again where can we find all your music at uh just uh google billy craig music or go to billy craig music.us we certainly will do so once again uh guitarist billy craig on the mike wagner show at black swan theory billy always a pleasure to have you on very big thank you for your time you're always amazing looking forward to having you again soon make sure you keep us up to date keep in touch and we definitely love to have you back and we'll see you on the road really soon mike wagner thank you so much appreciate everything that you do the mike wagner show is powered by sonic web studios if you're looking to start or upgrade your online presence, visit www.sonicwebstudios.com for all of your online needs. Call 1-800-303-3960 or visit us online at www.sonicwebstudios.com to get started today. Mention The Mike Wagner Show and get 20% off your project. Sonic Web Studios, take your image to the next level. Hey everybody, my name is Forbes Riley and I'm an American actress and a TV host. And I was delighted when I got my copy of Missing, which is Extraordinary Relation of Ordinary People based on a real life relationship. It's just, it's well written, it's amazing. You know, it talks about a man who has lost his wife and his daughter and it's very well done. I'm gonna highly recommend that you go get your copy of Missing. It is a powerful, exciting read. Mr. Mian Moshe Zia. 
He is the author of Missing. And I want to give a big shout out and a kiss all the way halfway around the world to my dear friend. Check him out at Mia's website. It's called www.miamotionzea.com. Missing, available on Amazon. Again, I'm Forbes Riley, and I will see you again soon. Bye-bye. Thanks for listening to The Mike Wagner Show, powered by Sonic Web Studios. Visit online at sonicwebstudios.com for all your needs. The Mike Wagner Show can be heard on Spreaker, Spotify, iHeartRadio, iTunes, YouTube, Anchor FM, Radio Public, and themikewagnershow.com. Please support our program with your donations at themikewagnershow.com. Join us again next time for another great episode of The Mike Wagner Show.